your hope for your birthday, the years to come? Well, I hope that many more people here in Taiwan come to the saving knowledge of Jesus Christ. And that's why I'm counting on my friends here to stay consistent with the Lord, to be the uh, bearer for Jesus Christ. And that way many people come to Jesus here in Taiwan. <laughs> <笑>好 <laughs> yeah, as a family, I think uh, we can share something like the place, share and share the blessing. How about we do it this way and this one of us? Don't preach, okay? Just for. Yeah. <laughs> Say something to encourage him or bless him. You, you know, and I want everybody to realize I'm officially a senior citizen now. So <laughs> I'm 60 years old. <laughs> and if you speak Mandarin, uh, Brenda can translate. <laughs> no problem. And we not can translate. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> Privilege to know Jeff and Donna during my pandemics. Yeah, and they are my stats. They grade my homework every week, and I just remember it was a really blessed time yeah, to and to be under your care. And I remember each time you give me the full grade <laughs> and just a lot of encouragement words and. Even they are like brothers, <laughs> but they serve, you know, they just give all. They hold nothing back. They just talk to people and they evangelize and 
McDonald to bring people to from McDonald to the rock. Yeah. So it's it's amazing. I, I didn't know this part of you before, but then I wow, you guys have such a passion for for people, for the lost. So you are my example. Because we, hold on, hold on. <laughs> because we were fortunate to meet people and share the gospel, but we can take them to the Youth Lift Commission uh, coffee bar there. That makes it so simple for us. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's not difficult to have to move our house and meet them again just by taking them to the Youth Lift Commission coffee bar. So, thank you so much. Thank you. Privilege to meet you. I think I almost can get a chance to attend your wedding. But that year, I don't know, I think probably I just joined Wyoming. But I, I for some reason, I kind of missed it. Yeah. Just kind of, I joined, but not people kind of invite me to go. So I know there is a wedding for Tala and Jeff, but I, I, and in the Naomi and Tim's house, right? All right? The reception. Oh, she, oh. Oh, not wedding. Oh, sorry, sorry. Yeah, yeah, reception. Reception. Yeah, kind of like a feast, you know, that people can come on that. But I just, uh, but after I have a chance to know you guys, and I think, of course, in the FMS, you know, so I think just last year when we went to the uh, States, and I just want to say uh, thank you for your hospitality during that time. Yeah, I really feel like I'm kind of overwhelming by you know your loving and caring from two of you. And uh, really, even I know it's only short time, two days. Three days, three days or uh, four days, uh, in cheaper, but I really feel like, wow, I kind of have a family in the overseas, mm -hmm. you know? And uh, I know we are probably not, we probably will not get a lot of opportunity to visit, you know, States again because I don't have any family relative there. But if I were have a chance, well, I will be really <laughs> happy to go again, you know? Yeah, but the others, I, I think I really see the, the heart you guys like serve the church there. Yeah, yeah. I know Dala people, I know Dala is like, but after like this trip, I also can see Jeff. Wow. That's why God bring you two together because that's more powerful <coughs> for the evangelists, you know. I see you guys like serving the Asian church and kind of go to pick up the students or you know someone uh, and go to the church or maybe a little kind of older lady, you know, visit them and kind of carry them and bring them to the church. Yeah, I think really, I know like our base, we more focus on the maybe like South and East Asia, you know, more undeveloped than that kind of country. Not so many missionaries say, oh, I'm going to go to the States to, to be a missionary there. But uh, for me, I feel like you guys just like a missionary there. They reach the people, actually, they are not from the States. Mm -hmm. See, from Asia, from, yeah, a lot of Asian there. So, yeah, I feel like a, I think God value this is all the same, you know. You no know, matter you are in the frontier, no matter you are in a more kind of comfortable country, you know, your own country, but I think God telling this is all kind of the same, you know. Because I think the work is the same, is because we all save the we try to, you know, share God's so we save the lost with your soul, you know. So you know just it's a really um, like a privilege to have you guys here and also we can celebrate your birthday here. Well, thank you. Yeah, really, I, I just feel like, wow. I hopefully, I really hope I, well, we can do something more for you guys. Yeah, but, but it's, it's really happy to see you back here for a short time. Mm -hmm. and hopefully one day maybe we can work together, I don't know, in Wyoming or church or somewhere. Mm -hmm. Happy birthday, Jeff. Well, Thank you so much, Sandy. That means so much because <clears throat> we, you were, you and Salah were our guests of honor there. I mean, we were totally blessed 
I never slept so good for three nights as, as, as I did. You know, because the presence of God came because into the door. Because guys. we make you so tired. <laughs> Like at nine o'clock, you can see Jeff is still like on the table, like uh, we sit yeah. like four of us uh, like uh, around the table. You can see Jeff is like, I know that it's Jeff's bedtime, <laughs> but Jeff is still hanging there, you know, <laughs> trying to like spend more time with us. That's true. <laughs> That's true. But we we had such a wonderful time from the bottom of heart. Thank you. Thank you too. Next, so, uh, in Chico. Yeah, I have a good memory there, and you just treat us just like your children, you know. You just take us to, yeah, this is a good place to go, and then this is a good place to see, you know. It just brought us to visit and to, you know, go some places. I'm enjoying the time, and thank you for you. You really have the, the father heart, and then we are kind of very comfortable to stay with you. And also, yeah, when we go there, and you always, she always said, you are the missionary, you know what, well, you are the, what the, uh, you, you are the ambassador of God and always be Christians. Actually, what I see in your life is, you are the real missionary. <laughs> you know, you always, you go somewhere and just talk with people and have talk, talk to them and share gospel with people. Not only in America, what I see. And when I saw you in Taiwan, last time we went to the market days, and then you also kind of chatting with people and sharing with people. Yeah, I, I really see you are a prayer. Uh, you, you really uh, like to pray. And since we, we finished the meeting from the Latin High School and went back on the way, yeah, we are going to dismiss. And then you say, let's pray for Zala. And that's two of you, and they pray for me in front of the shop. And three of us, we pray that uh, we pray together. So. I, I'm so touched, you know. You, you always have a heart. You want, to, you want to place the people and pray for the people. Thank you for your heart. You, you, you really live up the the kind of uh, Get more chance to talk with you guys, and then uh, <laughs> and, but I really feel. Uh, Actually, many people visit this space, uh, but I, I can really see that you are not waiting people to, to care for you or love you, but you love people first. You just share your love first and then get to know people. And then i really blessed by that. And also I really see Jeff's, Jeff, you have integrity. And also whenever you pray, you. You always say, oh, God called us to be faithful servant. I really feel you You have the spirit of fear for God. And I really feel, wow, uh, I really respect you. And then you both have parents, like, feeling like you really like a mom and you really like a father uh, figure. Mm -hmm. And then, and then, anyway, only few weeks I already feel wow so blessed and then I, I want to bless you whenever you go that um, sorry these few weeks I'm quite emotional <laughs> I, don't know, I, don't want to talk about. I, I want to bless you that wherever you go <laughs> um, God will bless you uh, with all kind of relationship that um, that God will choose special people to to like be your children or grandchildren give you special relationship with people and even a uh, very good friend and then bless your ministry in the States. Mm -hmm. I believe you already a blessing to them. Mm -hmm. You know, thank you so much. I mean, you're a person that speaks from the heart and you're a people-minded person. You and Suki have love flowing out of you and you share it with others. So thank you so much. In the beginning, I didn't know you, but from the tone and from the way that you talk on the phone, I heard one time or another before you got married. And then I, I kind of had that kind of feeling that um, you were a pretty outgoing person. <laughs> and it is, right? You are. And then I was very honored to be your bridesmaid. <laughs> and then, uh, and then we, we were in. Then 
academics. Yes, yes, yes. And from the years passing by, I really see that the lot that you have for people, you never change. And you always, always have the love for people where you really go. And then wherever you go, you will bring the truth, bring the gospel to others. This is something I really admire. Because it's not easy. And I really see the love that you have for help. And that's why you bring my help. <laughs> and really thank you. Thank you for having me. And then really thank you for being a big blessing in my life. Thank you. Also. Well, thank you so much, Francis, for that. Because my wife told me all about you, how you're so outgoing and loving, and you know, and I had the opportunity to meet you, and she was absolutely right. You're outgoing and loving, you love your husband and your three children, you know, plus Barbara Mao told me about you too, how you're outgoing and loving, and you, you know, you're probably one of the best translators that you with the mission here in Dunsway. Yeah. So, my, my goodness, you are just so gifted, just so gifted. Because I, I, I do remember that time in prayer at family ministry schools when the first group came up with something, the second group came up with something, the third group came up with something, and you guys didn't come up with anything. But that's okay. <laughs> I really see most of you. You really, you are just like the Bible says. You, when when somebody are in need, you always willing to take extra mile to work with that person. Mm -hmm. Thank you. Yes, so what I want to say. And hopefully that during the time when you are in Taiwan, uh, what what's in your heart that God will answer and then to guide your steps. And then you may be able to be renewed, but also be blessed. Not only to give out the blessing, but also receive the blessing from others as well.我覺得是啊。對對對,my you know, they were so excited when they when they hang out with you guys and then they feel like so honored and so being cared and so loved by you guys and then yeah, Zalot told me that wow, he felt like such a great honor because the way you guys treat them. So at that time I think, oh, I should go. <laughs> but okay, I think in the future there's opportunities there. And I know when God appointed us in the different different places, locations, in different timings, and it must be His His beautiful will, you know. And then so that in your 60, um, I mean birthday, and then but God brings you in Taiwan mm -hmm. and it can be celebrated. I think it must be something that God want to like bless you guys or talk to you guys, and then probably can think about that. Though. And yeah, maybe come come back to Taiwan or what? I don't know. But um, I think also this is a great blessing for us. Can hang out with you on your 60th birthday. And thank you for lift out this good example for us. So we will know that in the future, or we can start it from now. Like be just like you always say to all of us. Like okay, you are missionary, you are an ambassador. And then we think we can continue to learn from you guys. You guys are great, awesome, really. And I thank you for leaving out this model, this example for us. And then we can we can learn from you. Happy birthday again and bless your days. Okay, it's a little bit different how I know Jeff. Uh Okay, how I came to know Jeff is through your way. Uh, it was a really short time. Uh, but it is that, a very unforgettable wedding ceremony ever. 
全身呃都是白的那个那个呃西装。Okay, I remember you had a white suit on at that day. 我就看到帅。And you're just so so handsome, so good looking. 然后。那呃，因为大拉姐姐是我一九九三年那个 DTS 的校长。大拉 was the leader of my uh ninety three DTS school. 一九九三。所以我跟 Brenda 是同学。So Brenda was my friend. <笑><笑>然后，然后我那时候有点记得那天我呃，因为我们在那个嘉音教会，我们在教，他们在婚礼在嘉音教会。And then because your ceremony was held in the Grace Church, right? Goodness, especially pick a seat, sitting can sit and you can look at those this new couple. So while you uh, as the ceremony goes, and then I was sitting there and I was praying for you too. Okay. I was kind of smiling at the same time. Without any reason. Just always saying, oh, sure. One hand, I'm really happy. To see that the your marriage started in this way and in such a happiness, such a happiness. 虽然我自己那时候还在年轻。At that time, I was still young. I'm still young now. 然后，然后那时候我就一直跟神说，主啊，你一定要祝福他们，在未来就是他们婚姻之后，将来可以成为很多的帮助。And then I pray that, uh, God, that you will bless this marriage and in the future, and their their marriage will be a blessing. And I also pray that your marriage after you got together as one, then God, then you can work together in one accord and to serve the Lord. But in the other hand, I was kind of sad because I know she will be uh, fly into the states and live there. But in the But at that day, when you were on your wedding day, I really sense the blessing of the Lord on it. And I'm very honored that I can be participating in your wedding. And then I got a chance to meet with Dala. And then today, Dala told me that you are married for 16 years. Oh, I'm very surprised. Wow, 16 years ago. And then to me, when I heard 16 years, well, I was really surprised. This kind of time flies. 16 years is gone. And then in this time, I really see God's blessing on me. And during this time, I really see God's blessing on me. 不管是在家庭上，或是在呃服饰上，都非常注意。And then in the in the family, in the ministry, that God's blessing for you. 啊，那我要特别感谢祝福，今天在他家里为我做的祝福祷告。And I really want to thank Jeff, especially while I was in your house, and you make a blessing prayer upon him. 啊，在祝福今天的生日上，我想祝福他。And then um Jeff's birthday, I just want to bless you. 啊，就是在未来的日子，就是，呃，你们，呃，你们的事工不是只有在美国跟台湾。And then in the future, the ministry that you have is not only in the states and Taiwan. 哦，愿神使用你们，可以让神差派你到各国去帮助更多的人。May the Lord commit you to go to different nations and to help others. 然后虽然我对剧本认识不是那么的多，可是他从在那个婚礼上，他让我感觉到他是一个非常 nice 的。Even though that I don't know Jeff that much, but in on your wedding day, I really sense that you are a very nice person. 所以我很很嗯很开心，就是因为大家姐的关系，让我们认识到 Jeff. And I'm very happy because of God. That's why I can know you, Jeff. 啊，虽然在他们在台湾还有一个半月的时间。Even though you were still have one one. 
是，愿上帝祝福他们，代表着每一天经历到上帝很多的惊喜。May the Lord bless you in the days that you are in Taiwan to experience a lot of surprises and and it does miracles. Well, thank you so much. Thank you so much. Gave me some money for my cooking money, and this time he gave me some money for say, oh, in case you need to spend time with the this person, that person. But I kind of put it aside. Then finally, I. Ask the Lord uh, during the barbecue that day. Uh, I ask the Lord say how to bless Jack, and the kind of the Lord prompt in my heart say support Kathy Egypt, support Kathy Egypt, and because the, although both of us we cannot go to Egypt, so I said Lord I I really hate it like oh need to go to uh, same post. Post, post office, mail, it's hassle to me. I'm already feel like oh, overwhelmed. And it's so funny. I have that money Jeff gave me. So I will give to Jeff and Jeff will bless you. So because I remember uh, Pastor Dave called and say, uh, actually our life is no matter how much you have, it's how much God flow through you. So I said, oh, okay. Thank you, Lord, that we can uh, do this with Jeff gave me money, then I saved it, right? So I didn't use it. So we can bless the uh, county for Egypt. So it's like uh, uh, your uh, how to say your you can you can go to Egypt. Uh, you, so you don't need a swimming. So <laughs> so if you, in that way, I, I I know Jeff's heart. He I think said uh, in that way he will be blessed because. Uh, I accumulate money <laughs> and I give to Jeff and Jeff bless you. So this is it's a birthday, so it's that flowing. So that's God's principle for us to like no matter our life is doing life, but how much flow God uses us flow through. So right now we want to do do it this way. I will be like it down. So this is I bless Jeff and Jeff will bless Blessing you. you so just don't please, please don't open up in front of people. <laughs> <laughs> you, can, you, you can open that up later, okay? But it, it's our blessing to you because you're going to be a mighty servant in Egypt. Yeah. Yeah. So, so uh, I think that's God's heart. <laughs> I, I, well, I'm really, I feel I'm, I'm so, I don't deserve but God, I don't know why God loves me so, so much. Mm -hmm. And God just bring you here this time. Mm -hmm. It's just a privilege. Mm -hmm. Well, we, we were so blessed coming here because Brenda and Sandra met us. And Sandra took the luggage and just flew off those stairs. <laughs> and I, I was trying to keep up with her, but I, I didn't want her to know that I was helping the puffin. So once she went to open the door, I held my breath. <laughs> And then we, we finally got in there, and I took off my uh, shoes, and I was talking to, to Sandra. We were, we were, I was thanking her for the, uh, her heart for serving with her and stuff, and she told me about how valuable our student ministry was. And, you know, God spoke to me right then that our ministry's in Chico. And I asked God, what am I doing here? I came 6,000 miles to find out my ministry's in Chico. But God has us here for a reason. Uh, Humbleness, humility, learning. So we can take everything we learn and take it back to the Chico. And we're, we will tell about you, but we won't tell them your name. We'll say a friend of ours went to Egypt as a missionary. So I can we challenge the church in Chico. We, we don't want most of it to go after you. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> we, we, yeah, but we don't mention your name. Yeah. But I, I would like to thank Brenda and Sandra for meeting us on that Wednesday night. Yeah.